Unraveling the mystery, what are the odds? Hello everyone, and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're diving into a fascinating phrase that you might have heard in conversations. What are the odds? This phrase is a gem in English, packed with curiosity and wonder about life's unexpected moments. Let's explore together what it means, how to use it, and some examples to help you incorporate it into your everyday English. What are the odds? Is a rhetorical question used to express surprise or disbelief that something, especially something unusual or unexpected, has happened or is likely to happen. It's like asking, how likely is it that this would occur? This phrase can highlight coincidences, rare events, or the unexpected outcomes in life. This phrase can be used in various contexts, from casual conversations to more formal discussions. Here are some key points about its usage. Expressing amazement. When something highly unlikely happens, you can say, what are the odds, to express your astonishment. Commenting on coincidences, if you run into an old friend in an unexpected place, this phrase perfectly captures the surprise. Speculating about possibilities, it's also used to ponder the likelihood of future events, often in a humorous or rhetorical way. Let's see, what are the odds, in action with some examples. 1. Unexpected meetings. Imagine you're traveling abroad and you randomly meet someone from your hometown. You might say, what are the odds of us meeting here? 2. Rare occurrences. If you witness something extraordinary, like seeing a shooting star at the exact moment you look up, you could exclaim, what are the odds of that happening just now? 3. In games or bets. When something surprising happens in a game or bet, you might hear someone say, what are the odds of me winning twice in a row? Understanding and using the phrase, what are the odds, can add a layer of richness to your English conversations. It allows you to express surprise, speculate about possibilities, and comment on the quirks of fate in an engaging way. We hope this video has illuminated this curious phrase for you, making your English learning journey a bit more colorful. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next video.